All right, sorry about that. Mm-hmm. <sighs> mm-hmm. Uh-huh. But anyway, mm-hmm. now, if I'm at the morgue, though, and I come to a revive at that time, right, all you're trying to do is make sure I'm dead, right? You don't think God can resurrect me within the three and a half day period and you still not know if it's, I'm dead or not? I mean, Plus, they had me in the hospital for 14 days before whatever they were doing to me in there. <laughs> I'm mainly blacked out. <laughs> whatever they're doing in there. <laughs> for 14 days. From the 15th to the 29th. Right. But they gotta, they can't get rid of me then. <laughs> Whatever they're trying to do, I'm under their guard, <laughs> under their control. Mm -hmm. And whatever they're telling me, I'm not, ain't working, ain't working. <laughs> and I don't remember a lot of conversations with them <laughs> no, either, either. And is that normal for you to be totally blacked out after falling three stories, but you came to in the ER, right, in your room, right, and at certain times, but until the 29th, you're kind of totally blacked out, too. And, the, and they have you on the liquid diet, and you don't remember a lot, right? When you start coming, too, right? Mm-hmm. Um, you're in the bed a few days, because um, whatever they were doing wasn't working <laughs> up to then, either, either. Right, right. <laughs> and they said they had me on a liquid diet, I guess. <laughs> or was it a 14-day fast? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I, don't know. <laughs> I just don't really argue. <laughs> they showed up one girl's dress. <laughs> on this one, too. I didn't critique them before, but... <laughs> But I think Justice is with Epic, right? Not the you, whatever, right? I don't know. Mm hmm. And this is him and college and Drake, anyway, I know. Right, right. And his wife. Mm hmm. Mm-hmm. I think the one in the orange looks fine. <laughs> mm-hmm. Both girls there look hot. <laughs> Even the... <laughs> Next girl. Next girl. <laughs> and the one in the yellow back there... <laughs> Mm-hmm. Now I'm critiquing the models, right? And that they look hot. <laughs> you can do that, too. That's critiquing something different. <laughs> sure, sure. <laughs> like the cars, too, right? Two ladies there. <laughs> Well, that's the point. They definitely showed up her dress. Mm-hmm. <laughs> but like I said, you're showing your wife's side booth in lingerie. <laughs> and again, again, it's okay. I'm not saying it's right or wrong, but look at it from her perspective, too, and you're showing this video to the world, Justin. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
Um, those are fine girls. <laughs> All in leather. <laughs> Mm -hmm. You know I like her the best. So. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> right. Because <laughs> I told you about my dream right? of an Asian girl anyway. <laughs> and, uh, why did I have to tell you that? <laughs> Your daughter? <laughs> mm hmm. Had a dream where she thinks she's one of the two and you're trying to protect her from me. Like I arranged it myself. <laughs> and not God. And not God. There she is. They tried to will bear her. <laughs> you remember that movie that was in? <laughs> she looks like she's in a will bearer position and got left and gets inside the wall. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> well, I forgot the name of it, but it, it's the one with... Uh, James Franco, but the younger brother. Mm -hmm. All right, <laughs> let's see. <laughs> it's that Mr. Shower Boo Beam, <laughs> and, uh, and that's Epic Records, undefined, right? But he's with Epic. No, it's YouTube. If it's not Epic, it's not him or his label either. Either. <laughs> nope. But see, see, even they understand. I don't know who your wife is, Officer Martin. Why would she be with me? Why would she be with you? Are you treating her like shit? <laughs> and Daphne told her about me? <laughs> or Victoria? Because see, I don't know her. I don't know her. I still don't know her. <laughs> But like I said, I know what I'm being set up and it's bullshit. And, um, and that turn didn't even enter her side of the road. She and her mind, right? And there were two cars in front of me. She didn't have to swerve. Yes, she did. I keep telling you why. I know she's lying then. <laughs> if she says I just smashed into her and there went two cars in front of me, she's dying her ass off. <laughs> then she is. And didn't think she needed to mention that because the cars would be done gone, right? By the time you got there. <laughs> Why'd it take you so long anyway? Mm -hmm. But see, that's last year. This is this year. This year might be different with something, right? I don't know. See, this year can't prove what happened last year. Anyway. anyway. That was a year ago. That was a year ago. And we're still within our legal limits to file, right? Like he said, right? You got two years for any accident where there was a problem with the officer or not, right? <laughs> That's why I went after you first, right? And Judge Michael can't block it legally. No, he can't. Because <laughs> that's suspicious on him. I don't even know him either. I know you don't even know him either. Unless he was the same judge who Gave me the 10 year probation. Right. I'm supervised, right? And what he's doing. <laughs> Judge Judy cases now? <laughs> right. Right. <laughs> but was it? <laughs> and why do you do that? Because you became obsessed with my ex-wife and her uh, trying to set me up with her daughter. <laughs> Which has to do with me how. Mm -hmm. No, see, she couldn't do none of that well with me. I know she couldn't. And the only thing I would do, like I said, if she came in there or not, is be confused of her behavior. If I'm trying to help her go to the bathroom, she didn't get it, right? And then I'm trying to figure out other options, and then I stop, right? Mm-hmm. My mama taught me better than that. I <laughs> know she did. <laughs> trust me, trust me. Now, I might have made a few mistakes, right? But nothing like that, ever, ever. Not no four-year-old. <laughs> 
Anyway, anyway. Maybe three 12-year-olds could have tried something. I'm not sure. <laughs> but there again, they're telling me a sob story too, right? You know? And I don't know what to do about it. And I'm trying to talk them out of it, right? But then you make me just like him, right? <laughs> but again, I don't know. We're talking about things, right? See, it's better to discuss a play with someone before they do it. Anyway, <laughs> don't it look like something is missing from the scene? <laughs> right. Maybe I'm trying to stop her from doing that. And she caught me doing that, but I stopped, right? I didn't do nothing past that. But then we started arguing about it all, right? And I told her, well, that's what I was really trying to do. You can't read my mind. Even if you're recording it and watching it, you can't read my mind. Right? Don't mean I really have sex with her either, either. I also remember taking a shower with my mom when I was around three, right? Or four, myself. <laughs> now, mm -hmm. the problem is, right, I can't prove anything if I don't know what's going on. Mm -hmm. And I got, look as if I've been hit over the head a couple times, right? <laughs> Especially in the neck area, right? Not her, not her. <laughs> She had half her brain removed by using that thing. If it's the right hemisphere, the right hemisphere is your rational side of the brain, right? She's all imagination, right? She not Daphne hundred percent anymore either, either. She's not the girl her mom raised, right? And she was exposed to a lot of asshole men before she met me too. <laughs> I'm not trying to be that to her, I know you're not. I'm trying to give her a normal husband and wife relationship, actually. Yeah, there you are. Or she's taking care of me a little bit, and I'm kind of <laughs> there with her, but she's kind of not really <laughs> wanting to commit, I feel. Like. <laughs> same with Maryville, same with Maryville. And Sheena, for some reason, turned into a one-night stand, right? I would have, you know... Done her right too, right? <laughs> mm -hmm. And all I can say is I got theories about why, <laughs> but it don't mean I can prove anything, right? <laughs> but like I said, I don't know. Now, if I really concentrate, yeah, I can type better, but you're talking about on the manual typewriter. I know. <laughs> See, that's what I'm showing you, right? And distracted typing, you mm -hmm. All right, and I'm a C plus student, right? In school, I didn't even remember my grade <laughs> on the ship. <laughs> That's right. That's what I was telling. I don't remember my grade, but I didn't take typing class, right? I could be as good as him. What do you know? What do you know? But I ain't gonna tell you nothing if you're trying to, you know, make me do something stupid. I ain't gotta type up shit. <laughs> you do all that crap. You wanna do all that crap, right? But this will be something out of my memory, too. Like in the code red, Captain Carey. Mm -hmm. You know what those are. I've seen a few good men, too. But I've been code redded. <laughs> I don't know how often. <laughs> I don't know how many days. <laughs> but that's why I would keep referring to the car wreck and Jesus can tell me, like, in the car wreck. Whatever happened there, I don't know. <laughs> When you're blacked out, though, you can't say what happened, right? Only that you made it back home if they did it at night. And like I told you, the amnesia is to protect you more than me. Because <laughs> I don't know what happened. I don't know what happened. <laughs> I don't know what you did, so I can't witness to it. <laughs> but if it's that much trauma, that's called blackout amnesia, right? You're clearly not making me forget anything but what you tried to do to kill me again. <laughs> not trying to prove anything. <laughs> I keep telling you that too. But you got my injuries and you would naturally <laughs> be paralyzed from either the neck down or the waist down. And I'm neither. <laughs> so something going around here where God is intervening like he did with the people in the Old Testament. And you... And you where you can actually witness the miracles. So, no. But like I said, mm -hmm. 
It's not all about how you see things. Maybe people just need a different perspective now, right? Than what you thought happened, right? That's why I'm trying to reach them too, but in a non-forceful, this is the way it went, and I know it 100%. Well, maybe you're being a little superstitious, right? Maybe you're not realizing what's going on, right? It's like with the storms, right? Maybe Jesus just knew if he waited a few minutes, the storm would pass, right? And you acting all crazy like most men do, right? When you're in a storm, right? It's scary to you. Mm -hmm. But even when I was with and went on the ship, I too waited it out. I didn't get panicky like Jesus. Like Jesus. I know, I know. He brings you through the storms anyway. I know. But you gotta calm down. You need to calm down. <laughs> Like Taylor says. Uh -huh. <laughs> I don't know her either. But like I said, I know a pretty woman. When I see one. Mm -hmm. It's all I say. <laughs> it's all you can say. <laughs> but why do you want me to bring up anybody's name? I don't know. <laughs> Except as a star on the radio or a star on the TV, right? Katy Perry, whatever, right? I don't know her outside my life, right? Or inside my life, right? Except that she's a star on TV. That's all I should know about her, too, right? Now, if she knows more about me, okay, you're messing with her about me, right? In the first place. Or I don't even know what happened there, right? Like, I couldn't handle being with her either, either. See, see. And wouldn't do her right either, either, and said the wrong way. Is that the problem? I try to treat any woman like she is, wants to be my wife. How are you supposed to treat a woman? <laughs> to get her to stay. <laughs> to, to. But like I said, when you're rushing things with me, you know, like Daphne did, or Mary Bell did, or Gina herself did, right? Now, say I knocked her up, too, right? Two out of three, bad, huh? <laughs> right. <laughs> and see, hormones, honey, chemistry. If you're not telling me you're waiting for marriage, why do you think that was? <laughs> we were caught in, up in the heat of the moment, right? Like I said, right? <laughs> but whatever they wrote you. See, I ain't going to type no weird letters to my girlfriend when I'm writing her handwritten. I'm not going to switch to that. There's no reason for me to. I don't do that. I don't do that. And they sure as hell want me nasty or talk about evil shit I would or would do to someone, right? Because I have no clue what they would say. <laughs> I don't even go there with most people. Right? I'm not even a S and M type guy, I know, who would even put a woman in whips and chains and all that shit. Right? I'm not. I've heard of it. Right? I can't say I didn't. Right? But I've never done it. Right? I don't even recall doing a menage a trois. Right? Either, either. <laughs> right? Or being offered one. Either, either. <laughs> Right. The closest I came was Michelle and then Mary Bell after Michelle. <laughs> a few days, right? By the day, by the day. Well, I still had to drive up to... Um, I was with Michelle Wednesday night. Had to drive up. Broke up with her Thursday morning. Drove up. Thursday to go to the court on Friday. <laughs> Now, also, if I don't remember something, someone could have done something like steal my car, steal my ID, or steal my check. And again, I don't know. And I'm not not a trusting person anymore either. I'm not as naive, maybe, but like I said, I know. 
I'm the kind who will help you out when you're in a bind. And, uh, even if I regret it. Even if you regret it. But some people, whether they're electrocuted themselves or not, <laughs> just find a hell of a grudge against me. Like I know what's going on with them to hold the grudge when I don't. I know you don't. <laughs> and I can't be everything to everybody either. I'm a man. I'm a man. I'm not God to you. Nor am I Satan to you, nor am I Jesus to you, right? But we can all be like the man. To a point, to a point. But you are flesh and blood. <laughs> You're not pure spirit like God is either. <laughs> I saw what it represents itself as is a true light, a true light. Within your body, right? Without it, you're dead. You can call it bioelectricity, whatever you want to call it. It's not like simple a lightning strike. It's not like simple the sun. Though it's white outside the atmosphere, by the way. <laughs> it's a white light, too. I know it's a white light. <laughs> Just through the atmosphere, it looks yellow. Mm -hmm. By the way. <laughs> they found that out when they sent the probes out there, too. Right. <laughs> They didn't know either. They didn't know either. But it's an assumption. Right? Now the moon could really be white too because it's reflecting the sun and it's a rock. Right? The huge rock in the sky to control the, also the oceans and tide. Right? It serves two purposes too. Right? But like I said, you know, we have choices. Are you making a right choice or a wrong one? No. But are you doing it for me or someone else? Right. And like I said, if you want to be with me, be with me, but don't be with me where I don't know I'm with you. Right. That's suicidal as well. Mm -hmm. When I'm looking for a girlfriend and I'm single, you got to be single to mingle too. <laughs> Whole point. Or you're wasting our time. You're in my because you know what jealousy is caused by. Mm -hmm. As well. Mm -hmm. Cheating, cheating. <laughs> and like Nick said, he still gets jealous. I still get a little jealous, but I'm more in control. Right? But like I said, you're the one married to Priyanka and ain't had a child yet. Mm -hmm. That's weird. That's weird. And it don't take this long to have a child, Nick. <laughs> Mine happened within a day, <laughs> we even four days, four days, or less, or less. Now, <laughs> damn, could have been the second day. Could have been the second day. 